lock lovers and lock kings and queens and welcome back to another lock video so today's video is going to be five signs that you are ready to start your lock journey now so um this video is kind of similar but different than the video i did over a year ago on five signs that you are not ready to get locks um and if you guys have not seen that video you guys can check that video out i will uh, link it in the description box down below um so now we're going to get right on into uh five signs that you are ready to go ahead and start your lock journey sign number one is you google everything about locks so every time you are on google or you have your phone you are looking up stuff about locks you are researching locks you are trying to figure out how to start locks you are trying to look up different things what products you need to use what products you don't need to use you are just googling everything about locks sign number two is that you are constantly watching lock videos on youtube okay this was a deal breaker for me because i was constantly on youtube looking up all the lock videos i could i watched so many lock videos y'all it was ridiculous like i was constantly watching lock videos constantly following through everybody else's journeys and looking from their start to their finish and going through and looking at all their updates and stuff i was obsessed so that's a sign is you will be obsessed watching lock videos sign number three is you have created a pinterest board just for locks okay not for nothing else not for food not for you know decor or anything else but just for locks like not even for natural hair but for locks i have two separate pinterest boards for hair like one is for natural hair was that was the one i always had just natural hair the beauty of it and all of that then i had to create me a separate board for locks because it's locks. I mean, come on. It, it just deserves a board on its own. So that was a sign right there for me. I had to create my own Pinterest board for locks and I still add to it right now. So sign number four is that you wear your hair in protective styles all the time and you dread when it's loose. <laughs> okay. Y'all catch that someday. But anyway, yes, you wear your hair in protective styles all the time so you're constantly wearing your hair in twists or you know maybe you've got faux locks or um you know braids or you're constantly whatever it is mini twists um you're constantly wearing your hair in protective styles because you just don't want to deal with your hair which leads me to five and that is you hate combing your hair so for me protective styles i really was not wearing my hair in protective styles wait i take that back i was I was wearing wigs before I, I started locks. Yeah, I started wearing wigs a lot because I just didn't feel like combing my hair. So that is another sign. You just, you hate combing your hair. I was fed up with that. I know personally, I just did not want to comb my hair anymore. I was tired of the shedding. My hair was excessively shedding and all of that stuff. I'm being 20 and a half months in, knowing I have not combed my hair in 20 and a half months, almost two years. I love it I love it love it love it so if you have found yourself in any of these signs or maybe all five let me know comment down below it might be time for you to you know go ahead and just take the leap of faith and start your log journey a lot of people reach out to me and you guys are just trying to figure out you know man should I start my logs I've been thinking about it for a long time and you know I don't know I'm scared if you have been thinking about it for a long time and it's heavily on your mind and it's something that you know you have a piece about go ahead and take the leap of faith and go ahead and start your log journey um what are you waiting for and that's the question i'm asking to you guys what is it that you're waiting for leave a comment and let's get a dialogue started here if you have not started your log journey and you really really strongly want to and you haven't what is it that you fear or you know what is it that's holding you up in the process let me know let's talk about it in the comment section below thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope that you all enjoyed it i hope that it was beneficial to you in some way if so give it a thumbs up make sure you guys subscribe and i love you all and i will see you guys in the next vlog video bye guys